almost successfully, and the flight proceeded according to plan for some distance. During this time, the missile was stable in pitch, yaw, and roll. Then a failure occurred involving one engine. And shortly thereafter, another engine also lost power. It was therefore necessary for the range safety officer to destroy the missile by remote control. Debris from the missile fell on the test base and in the sea just offshore from the base. Nearly all critical components were recovered. These parts and data radioed to the ground during flight were studied to isolate the exact cause of the trouble.